On to three. A fun faculty bonding activity. Right. Teachers at Ladies Island Middle took part in a school-wide scavenger hunt. The educators were broken up into small groups, mixing new teachers with veterans. The goal of this activity is really to start forming those collaborative connections and relationships among staff members. This year, although it's different than last year, it's still going to be very challenging. And I am going to need for all of my staff members to be able to count on and rely on each other. And what better way to start that beginning process through bonding in an activity like this. Each group worked together to solve 20 clues as they move throughout the school. We have to read the clue and it's in a pun form and we have to decide where it's at in the building and then we have to go and we are actually making it interactive and fun. Once they get to these locations they are going to have to get very creative and take a photo of them and their group in that spot and upload that to a Google slide and we're gonna judge the most creative photos of course with the correct answers in the responses to award the winning team with their prizes. The activity not only encouraged the educators to collaborate it also provided opportunities for the new teachers to explore the school building and learn their way around. On our group I was the only new teacher so they really helped me figure out just the locations and just the way around the building so if I didn't have them I would be clueless and probably still walking down the hallway. I enjoy working with everybody and getting to know the new teachers as well as getting to know some of the veteran teachers that I didn't have a chance to really work with last year because we were all separated because of COVID. It's been great because I'm getting to network with a few of my new colleagues who I'm hoping to be working with as as I am going to be team teaching with a lot of these new teachers from the library. To win the scavenger hunt, teams had to find and photograph their locations. Points were awarded for the most creative photos submitted, and members of the winning team will be given gift cards as prizes. At Ladies Island Middle School, Ron Lopes, Beaufort County School District.